formally, I reference 17th century Chinese export porcelain. And this was part of the east-west trade. Uh, it was geared for a European audience, and it tended to either be blocky or round. Uh, I also reference uh, uh, potters such as George Orr, the Mad Potter of Biloxi, and uh, contemporary studio potters like Warren McKenzie. But surface-wise, I look at non-ceramic surfaces for inspiration, and things such as weathered painted wood or weathered painted brick. Uh, I even would say old circus, vintage circus posters are an influence. If you look at most contemporary studio artists, in one way or another, we make a comment about ceramic history. But the forms that I needed to create that would fit with the surface needed to be blocky. So what I did was I, I went to the history books and did research on forms that tended to be uh, very geometrical in nature. So that's how that came about. So it's a way of uniting the form and the color together.